Hey guys, I'm Mr. Fetty here, and today's gonna be a new like set review and this time it's a Lego like, Marvel set which is called the Ghost Rider Mech and Bike set with which set number is seven six two four five has two hundred sixty four pieces is for and it's for ages seven and up, so yeah. So first is the box. So here's the front of the box and this is like your typical forty dollar size box and here's the Here's the top, which shows the actual size of the Ghost Rider minifigure. There's a side, which has nothing. And there's a bottom, which has a little ad for the a Lego app. So, yeah. And there's a side, which is just the Lego Marvel logo with some, like, some different Marvel characters in the background. So, yeah. And here's the back of the box, which showcases, like, uh, you know, some, the rest, some, you know, the mech and the bike. Without the, you know, the, combine them into riding it and... There's the Ghost Rider, and there's a Ghost Rider look, uh, symbol right here, so, yeah. And the Charger Mini, which, it looks kind of big, and, which has a total of 63 pages to build, and there's no ads, besides the Lego service ad, and the, and there's the win ad, featuring the just the generic guy with a cup on it, and, yeah, just like the other sets I have reviewed for... 2023, uh, the, and also, I think some from 2022, the, it, the manual wasn't as colorful as the, as the, as the box, so, yeah, kind of disappointment. So, now onto the, to the, the one and only minifigure, you know, just one minifigure that was included in this, to this set, so, yeah, here we go. So, the minifigure here is Johnny Blaze, aka Ghost Rider, and, <clears throat> wow, this is a pretty impressive uh, minifigure, you know, and let me remove his weapon just for just for being distracted. And the printing on, on Ghost Rider by the front, you know, the front printing on the torsos looks looks pretty nice now. And also, I don't know, there's like, like a little orange on the, that was like noticeable on his coat, on his jacket. So, yeah, no back printing, and there's no black printing too. Kind of disappointing. And here's the back printing, which has a little little chain on on his back so yeah and also the the head which this little flame piece which it which i think it's glue on so you can't like remove it which is i think that's kind of understandable since since it's always been part of since the, the, the skull the skull spider's head that was on fire is always a part of him and you can't remove the flame on him so yeah and also the accessory for ghost rider is this is the his chain weapon so yeah but you can like uh whipping around such whipping around some baddies so like this. <laughs> so yeah, um let me, let me connect that okay, there it goes. Alright, connect that back, so yeah. So that's Ghost Rider and now for the for the Ghost Rider mech. So for the Ghost Rider mech, uh it looks kinda of a bit boring and all, but has a nice coloring of the orange, grays, and uh Black and the light gray, and let's compare this mech to the Phantos mech I have reviewed like back in like I think April, I think. And just look at the comparison, you know. Uh, well, well, the Phantos mech has like a lot of details, you know, like the little purple muscles right here, and this the Affin the Affinity Gauntlet, and the the sword, and also the feet are a little bit bigger, or you know, well, rather big. Well, Ghost Rider Mac, the feet are small, the, it looks, it looks a little bit boring, you know, and, yeah, so that's because, you know, this mech, this mech is kind of a bit boring, so, you know, it should have been better if it has, like, has a little more flame pieces that probably are, that it's, like, on each side, so, yeah, so let's move the Phantom's mech away, and, you know, so you can pretty much open the little, this little door thing, and you can put, you can put Ghost Rider on the mech to ride on it, so yeah. So here it goes, and also articulations on the on this mech, uh, same as always. You know, you can move the arms, you can move the fingers like this. Which these ones are black, while I think the Phantom mech is like gold, like right, yeah, like right there, yeah. yeah I think the Ant Man one is like also black, so this is like kind of a reuse. So, which is kind of a bit lazy, you know, since these Ghost Rider mech fingers have kind of been reused for that little Ant-Man figure, and also, 
the back, uh, nothing else, but you can like move the, like the, the torso, the torso like left and right, and also the feet you can like move in, or the legs you can move in up and down, and the feet you can just move it sideways, and that's all you can move in them whatever you want like this. So yeah, and also there's like a little, there's like a little missing piece here, which is actually probably the part of the, part of the you know, the, the chain weapon. You can, like, connect the chain weapon like this. So, let me put, the, put this around, and there it goes. So now the, the chain is part of the Ghost Rider mech, and, yeah, the, the mech is c kind of boring, you know? There's just, you know, there's not any, there's not, like, all the details, you know? Like, it should have been better if it's had, like, more fire on this, more fire pieces to put it on the sides of the, on the arms and legs, and... Yeah, so, so that's the Ghost Rider mech. Now for the bike of the Ghost Rider mech. And here's the, the Ghost Rider bike. And, wow, this is actually, you know, this is kind of worth it to get the set is this bike, you know, like, man, this is like, almost like a, you know, like your typical, like, uh, these bike, these bike statues, like, they're in this size, like, I felt impressed, you know, like, yeah, there's, like, a lot of interesting details, you know, like, the, like, there's, like, this printed piece, which has the eyes to, pretty much, you can, like, make it into, this, yeah, this piece, which has printed eyes on it, which pretty much resembles of a skull, right here, so, yeah, and the handlebars, you can, like, move them up and down, like, the, the, the bottom half, the bottom of the handlebar, you can move it up and down, and this, you can, like, in the top part of the handlebar, you can, like, move it left and right. So, yeah. And here's the back of it. And, yeah, there's, like, a lot of flame pieces, you know, on here than the, this mech, sadly. So, yeah. And, and also the wheels, you know, there's, like, this, you know, the, this is, this wheel piece has, like, the orange, uh, inner part of the wheel. And there's, like, translucent orange pieces, which I think this is the same one for the, the mansion room set and the these are but these are like yeah these but these are translucent orange which kind of look more jack o' lantern color so yeah and you can like move it move it around you know it's pretty fun to play with but there's like a little clip on right here which on this piece so yeah and that's what I forgot there's like lots of next night shields on this set which which is from which is here on the bike and here on the on the mech, the Ghost Rider mech. So yeah, and you know for the clip on, there's no since there's like a there's a bottom of Ghost Rider which has like a little clip on too. So yeah, and let me put them let me put the mech let me set the mech down and just hang on let me get to connect that so it can, so can like make it looks like it's writing and yeah and let me put. Yeah, you could like put the feet on these little, these fins, you know, which is part of the, these bike piece, you know, which you like, make it look like it's moving, so yeah. And you can like move, put the, put the hands on the handlebars to make it look like it's, yeah, you can like put the, hold the handlebars on the, on the hands to move it. Let me just try my best to get the move, man. I think I almost got it. Yeah. Okay. This is like the best I could for having the mech just riding a bike. So yeah. Now it looks pretty complete. So yeah. And so yeah, this is pretty interesting, you know. Which yeah. So now for the, the my final thoughts on the set. Uh, I pretty like this set, but you know, even for the the mech looks kind of whoops. Even for the mix looks kind of boring, you know, since, you know, it's going to be better if it has, like, more flames on each side of the arms and legs. But the bike, the bike is definitely worth it, you know. And especially has, like, a lot of interesting pieces, you know, like the, this, like, this piece has the, the printed skull eyes on it. And that's, like, that's why I don't know. Oh, you can, like, move the, this, uh, the upper jaw, like, up and down, but just, like, had to like, put it perfectly on the... On this, but also like there's like a flaw which sometimes the bike you can just sometimes the 
there's no kickstand in the bike, so it can like always like always fall off on each side. So yeah, and also lots of interesting pieces like these little two pieces, which they come in like in this metallic, this in metallic color. So yeah, and and I think there's some yeah, and also this this piece, which is part of the from the biddable figure sets. You know, mostly these the Spider Man ones and the Ant Man one, which those like come in like in metallic gray, which is pretty interesting. So yeah, and also I think yeah, the, the also the little candle pieces which are also in in a metallic color. So yeah, pretty interesting. So yeah, lots of interesting uh, recolor pieces. You know, just a little bit more, make it a little more metal it, a little more metal as heck for for Ghost Rider and his iconic bike. So yeah, so. Yeah, it's a pretty great set, you know, it's just since, you know, the bike can much carry it, carry the set, so, so ranking on the set, um, I'm gonna give it a, an 8.5 out of 10, you know, the design of the mech, for the Ghost Rider mech is pretty boring, but the bike, it definitely carries it, so, yeah, and, and also a lot of good, you know, recolored pieces, you know, like, you know, the, like, the, the candle pieces, the, the shoulder pad piece, and, I think these are like like brand new pieces, I think. So yeah, and also the whole issue is the there's no like kickstand on the bike, which sometimes you, it just like fall off on on its on its whatever side. So yeah, just be careful of it. So yeah. <clears throat> so anywho, uh, I just hope you guys enjoyed this video and like it, comment this video, and subscribe for more content. So this is Mr. Freddy here, and I hope you have a brick tastic day. So bye, and see ya, Ghost Rider.